All right, guys. So, quick video. The, um, I'm replacing the RCAs on this because apparently they went bad. You know, over time they kind of do from tucking the wires in and wrapping them up and whatnot. So, uh, you know, I'm just decided that I'm going to fix it up to where I'll be able to connect and disconnect the RCAs using female ends coming off. You know. Um, so these will be running out of the table as opposed to having to hardwire the uh, RCAs directly in to the, uh, the, the uh, circuit board again because it's a pain in the ass to have to solder and desolder you know over time because over time these start to go bad and typically it's usually here on this end so anyway Years ago, I bought these off of a buddy of mine, and I already have done the uh, internal grounding mod here. So you can see where I internally grounded it, cut the wire, and then just soldered it directly to the, the uh, left channel ground. But uh, I already finished one of the tables. Uh, this is the second one. But what I wanted to tell you is, make sure, you know, when you're soldering these back in, make sure that you use some type of... Uh, desoldering or pro wick desoldering braid something like this to take the old solder off of the circuit board um, for some reason techniques decided you know we should just cake this stuff on here and if there's too much solder on the circuit board uh, and if it's really old what will end up happening is it'll actually uh, decrease the output of sound uh, there's just too much there's it's not clean the solder's not clean so it's gonna create a resistance within the audio signal Man, that sounded pretty smart didn't it but anyway um, so make sure after you desolder all these and take all this off uh, that you clean off the circuit board and then just uh, put some new solder on there you know some clean solder back on the board uh, but yeah, because I, I did it with the first one and I was having some uh, audio issues with one of the channels. And um, that's what I ended up doing afterwards. I was trying to cut corners and then it just ended up taking me more time because I didn't clean off the soldering uh, or the solder off of the, the board the first time. So anyway, um, hopefully that'll help you guys out. And um, I'll post another video after I get it finished. But for now, peace.